What's up, this is b wave Insanity, and today we're gonna learn how to do a kick up. Now, kick up is a move I first saw when watching martial art movies, and today you often see it in break dancing and a couple other dances. So, right now I'm gonna show you guys how to do it correctly. Alright, so the first thing we're gonna do is learn how to do a bridge, and this is actually gonna be the easiest way to do your kick up. So, what you're gonna do is you're gonna lay down with your feet here, a little bit wide, and your hands with your thumbs by your ears. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna lift your hips up and also lift your chest to the ceiling. So you're here, you lift up, and you're just gonna hold that. So try it again. You're on the ground, and then you lift up. So to add the kick up into this, what you're gonna do is you're gonna roll back with your legs and your hips off the ground to here. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna kick, and at the same time, you push into that bridge. So it's here, push, bridge. Try it again. Roll back, push, bridge. So next we're gonna learn how to kick up to our feet. Um, and the way that we do this is we use our neck. Our neck really gives us a lot of leverage in kicking up from our back to our feet. And I like to call this the Chris Brown technique because in his music videos he often does this to go talk to girls and whatnot. But we're actually gonna use it to kick up from the ground to our feet, use our neck. So you can pretend I'm laying on the ground and I'm kicking up. My neck kind of whips me off the ground. So let me show you that one more time. From here, I kick and my neck kind of just whips me off the ground. And that's gonna be the best way for us to get that extra lift. All right, so now we're ready to kick up from our back to our feet. And what we're gonna do right now is land with our feet a little bit wider. That's gonna help you kind of, you know, baby yourself up all the way until you're completely straight. Um, the other thing is when you guys roll back, you want to think of yourself as a spring. And basically you're compressing the spring and exploding out. But if you lay back, a lot of people tend to stay on their back for a long period of time. And what happens is you, you don't get as much energy. So as soon as you roll back, you got to explode forward. So you're going to go here, back, and explode forward. Let's try it one more time. So you go back, explode forward, and try to land with your feet wide um, at first. And as you get better, what you're gonna do is your feet are gonna come together and basically land straight up. So let me show you guys one more time. And that's the kick up. 